Hello guys, it's Shrimp Time here and welcome in yet another interesting video about shrimp keeping. Today we are going to talk about the bacteria, about bacteria in shrimp tank and what bacteria products should we use. There is enormous amount of bacteria products for shrimp keeping. There are many products, there are also products for fish aquarium, for plant aquarium, a lot, a lot of good products. But if you are a beginner or you are trying to start with shrimp keeping, you can have big problems with deciding which bacteria should you use and how should you use them. So if you are interested in this topic, please stay tuned. Starting our topic, we have the first group of bacteria and we need to talk about nitrifying bacteria because they are the most important bacteria at the beginning of the life cycle of the tank. You can have two different types of bacteria. You can have bacteria in liquid and you can have bacteria in powder. There is different way of producing those bacteria but you won't be able to buy nitrifying bacteria which are alive. I only know one product, one product in whole shrimp keeping hobby that claims that is giving you live nitrifying bacteria. And those would be doctors teams bacteria and they've got their own way of starting tank. But the problem is that those bacteria need to be kept, need to be storaged in a range of temperature. Those bacteria need special storing conditions because they will live in the bottle only in this range of temperature. If you will put them in different temperature, then the whole magic is gone. So because I don't know how the shops are storing those bacteria, I won't believe them. So guys, both, both types of bacteria will have the sprouts of the bacteria. The bacteria that are inactive and uh, that will need time to start living in the tank. And if we are talking about nitrifying bacteria, it's something about seven days. In my opinion, this is one of the best liquid product of the bacteria, but it, this opinion isn't based on the science, it's based mainly on my experience. Nowadays, I'm only using this type of bacteria for starting my Caridina shrimps, and I also use SL aqua nitrifying bacteria for Neo Caridina shrimps. Second type, this is the powder bacteria. I don't use them, but I know many people that will uh, use those types of bacteria and that will have a lot of success with those types of bacteria. The important thing which you need to remember is that even if you won't add those bacteria to your tank, the tank will get its nitrifying cycle done because the nitrifying bacteria are almost everywhere. In my opinion, those bacteria are only to make things happen faster. And this is why I use them. Sometimes I will add them also for water changes, but in my opinion, it isn't the crucial thing because once your tank is established with your bacteria, it's like adding non-active bacteria to the tank that got active bacteria. Second, very interesting type of bacteria. This is million bacter powder from SL Aqua. And this is interesting topic uh, because it used diatomite sand, the diatomite earth. And this is very interesting media source because it has the possibility 
to connect with the bacteria. If you put this media inside of a tank with some bacteria, there is a very big possibility that the bacteria will be connected with this media. And I'm not sure, I, I need to say you that I'm not sure if million bacteria got only the pure earth or if they use it as a surface for the bacteria. I'm not sure. They claim that they use it for a surface for the bacteria, but I also have seen some of the reviews that are saying that this product didn't have any effect on the nitrogen in the tank. But in my opinion, this product can affect your tank with connecting the bacteria that will bring disease to your shrimps. So very interesting product, but SL Aqua Magic Powder, one of the best shrimp products on the market. Very, very good product. And also contains the fungus, um, they, especially the yeast, because this product is created on the fermentation process, almost sure that the main living thing in this product is the yeast. And very interesting thing is that it's got decomposed long sugars in the product which are used for shell building. In my opinion, it's got nothing to do with nitrogen process. It's for feeding the shrimps, and this is the main thing that I love SL Aqua. This is not the end. We are going to the third type of bacteria, or fourth, sorry, that I use. It's from American company Microblift. The best thing for running tank for water change. All of my tanks runs on special brand from microbes. These are very interesting bacteria because they need carbon source to thrive and to have the life process done, to digest, to eat the nitrogen. And this is why the manufacture of these bacteria will add caramel to their product so that the bacteria got their food source and are able to process the carbon in your tank. And these are very, very good bacteria that will lower your nitrogen, they will lower your phosphate, and they will develop biofilm for the shrimps to feed as well. Very good product. For me, it's a must. I will always use this. And now I'm trying also therapy from microblift and both of these bacteria will smell awfully but the manufacturer claims this got different microorganisms than the special brand they are in some sort they are similar in some sort they are different and that you can use both of the product very very important thing if we are using both the special blend, the therapy, you need to follow the instruction from the company because both special blend and therapy can affect your pH. They can lower the pH of your tank due to very rapid, very fast bacteria growth and breeding. Those bacteria that are in those bo both products will multiply very fastly and they will do that as long as they have carbon source in the tank. So as long as you will keep the process, you will keep feeding those bacteria, they will multiply. And the food source for those bacteria are in both of those bottles. I hope that this video showed you 
what do I use for my shrimp kidney? As you can see, we are in a new spot. We are in a new place. This is my new breeding room. I'm still working on it, but let me know in the comments if you like it. You can also follow me in the Insta on the Instagram. You got the link in the description. And remember, keep on shrinking. And guys, I forgot to add, if you don't know how to start Caridina shrimp tank, just click this video. See you.